we're already talking about some tropical trouble. A tropical storm swirling in the Atlantic Basin. It's the South Atlantic. It, it, its name, Akara. It's the first tropical storm to form in that area since February of 2021. Sea surface temperatures there are warm in the upper 70s, enough to support tropical activity, even the low 80s. Now, Acara, it's located well off the coast of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Beautiful on the beaches right now. I mean, look at that turquoise water. It's summertime in the Southern Hemisphere and uh, your typical summertime rain and thunderstorms for Rio. That's what we're expecting today. You see a few clouds. Nothing associated with Acara, but still one to uh, to mention, especially given the rarity of it. And, and when we're looking at it, the, the one key thing that grabs my attention, Kendall, is the way it's spinning. South mm -hmm. of the equator, you get that clockwise rotation instead of that counterclockwise rotation. You can think the re rotation of the Earth, the Coriolis effect having that. But this thing received a name. It was subtropical at first questions if it would become purely tropical and it looks like it did quite yeah. a feat. Yeah, it did. We've got the warm sea surface temperatures yeah. that are in the upper 70s. That's to blame. And then also the fact that, again, when we're considering what's going to happen over the next oh, few hours and into tomorrow, it's going to continue pushing southward. So it's going to generally remain offshore. That's the good news. But remember, it's February, after all, mm -hmm. in February and March, historically speaking, are the least active months out of the entire year right. for tropical activity. And so there's only two storms dating back to, to 1850, Stephen, that we've actually had uh, named storms during the months of February and March. This year, though, it's, uh, it's pretty interesting you to see what's happening. You see this graph, and it typically yep. starts in June, July. Not that we can't have them out, outside of it. Notably in the South Atlantic, too, there's an excellent write-up on our Fox Weather uh, website about this. The South Atlantic doesn't really have a set hurricane season, but, but when we do see them, they typically occur between December and May. And you think of that being the summer, even the early fall, so, so it does make sense. But